I'm Marcel Darius with the Buffalo Bills, and this is my dog D with the Princess, and you're here with UnleashedMagazine.com. I'm Marcel Darius, former player of the University of Alabama, currently with the, Univers currently with the Buffalo Bills. Cool, cool, cool. What position you play? I'm D Tackle. I was the number three pick overall in the 2011 draft. Cool, man. Tell us the name, Marcel, of uh, of your dog. Um, we got an English Bulldog. Her name is Diva. Her name is Diva. Tell us a little about my uh, Diva. Um, she got a name when I went to go pick her up in Rochester. Um, for my boy D David, man. He um. He told me what kind of dogs he had, and I went out there and checked them out, and she was the first one to come out. And so she's just been relaxed ever since. Okay. She a diva though. She did why you call her diva? Uh, you know, she 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 take over the room when she in there. Like a lot of people like her, and she know how to get everybody's attention. So that was she always been a diva in my book. <laughs> Tell us a little about her personality. She lays around. She's kind of lazy, more of a laid back type of type of dog. If you want to just, you know, what I'm saying? I come home from practice and just relax. She come in, play with me for a little bit, and then she get tired and she fall out of sleep with me. So she she ain't gonna be the type of dog that's gonna be all over the place with. She just real chill, get everybody's attention, relax. Is there any reason why you wanted the uh, English Bulldog? I look at myself when I look at them, so they just real nice dogs, laid back and kind. Do you uh you travel with uh you travel with Diva? Yeah, Diva, she come to New York with me. She, she come to New York with you? Go to Buffalo, New York. She chill out there with me a little bit. Or um, I get a ship back to Birmingham, we can chill with the family. So she go on trips just like the family do. So you um you feel it's important to keep your dog socialized. You just, I heard you just say that you keep it around the family, so you important to keep your dog socialized with other people, huh? Yeah, I want my, I want her to be so I want she's a part of the family. She's there with the family, yeah. So if the family can come, she can go. What cool. you think about adopting dogs? Like, you know, dogs that are in uh, humane society, shelters that don't have homes, you know, they don't. That's 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 kind of what I want to do. I want to do that. But I just got to get into it. Um, I want to get with a couple of shelters and see what what kind what they have to offer, and see what um see what kind of programs they got, and um, see if me and my brother we can get into it. We all gonna adopt some dogs, and, and we we like it. I mean, I love to have a companion from the shelter and just relax. Do you have any special advice to anyone who's uh, about to get a dog or, or thinking about owning a dog, you know, how to better their relationship with their dog? Or? I mean, be the best thing I can tell you, if you're going to get a dog, I had a dog my whole life. Yeah, if dog. you're going to get a dog, make sure you treat the dog with respect. Just treat like you want to be treated. Of course, the dog would just, you know, they have feelings too. Yeah, man, I, throughout the whole shoot, I was noticing you and uh, his uh, interaction, you know what I'm saying, uh, you and uh, Diva's interaction, man, I see uh, y'all get along real well, you treat her real nice, you know, um, how do you think, how do you think you form that relationship with her, man? I mean, just always take care of them. Dogs know who take care of them, you know. I spend time with her, I feed her, I make sure when I'm home, I call them, we, we, we spend a good deal of time together. And I never put my hands on her, never harm her. She know I'm a safe baby. You know she can come to me and talk, just chill.